Second, and it's about 6.30 a.m. Um, and can you believe it? I didn't film it, but can you believe it that I'm 139.8 today? I have not really been dieting. Um, all I wanted for the wedding was to get into the 130s. Um, I don't know if I did because I didn't have a scale since I was um, not in my house. So... But I just can't believe that I woke up today and it was 139.8. Ah, that's crazy. Finally in the 130s like I wanted without even really dieting. I mean, I'm not eating crazy, but I'm not like watching super strict like I was for the wedding when I'm eating. So that noise that you hear, that's Buttercup drinking water. She makes so much noise. Um, anyways. I've uploaded two videos already, so I'm pretty proud of myself back to back. Um, it is a little bit hard getting home kind of late and then having to edit, and I'm so tired, but doing it all for you kids. Um, not really sure what this video is going to be, maybe a full day of eating. So I will take you guys to my kitchen with me. Much different than what I always eat on a regular basis. My breakfast is always cream of rice with one scoop of protein powder. Um, I go to the gym, like today I went to the gym and I did weights. I go on a fasted state, um, not because of anything. I know a lot of people don't recommend it. I just get out of bed and run to the gym and don't really have time to eat anything. I do drink my BCAAs, um, my muscle mass has not gone down like I'm still able to keep muscle which is very very hard when you're running as much as I am training for a marathon um so that means that my protein intake has been good um so I'm really happy about that I don't really recommend that you go on a fasted state one second I don't really recommend that you go on a fasted state um some people might not feel well doing it you should have a little something to eat, like a protein shake. Um, so I might start doing that. Not sure yet. The fasted state really works for me. Um, on my long runs, I don't do a fasted state. I do have a little, like half of my cream of rice with one scoop of protein. Um, so I'm gonna go eat it now, and then I will catch you guys later. Hey guys, I'm back. It's 9:30, and I've got my wifey shirt. Cute, huh? So I have really bad heartburn and someone told me that baking soda with some water takes it away. So we're going to try it. Ouch, me luck. I can't even open it. Come on down. Kind of cool head. Half a teaspoon. That's what she says in the box. Half a teaspoon. 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 Half a cup of water. How much is like... Do you think this is about a cup? There's not, yeah, that's about a cup, so take half of it. Okay. This is full. full. My God, I'm very scared to do this. Why are you scared? Because it probably tastes like shit. Okay, I hope it works. There is nothing. Cheers. Oh God. It's very salty. It's like, like salt water, like the ocean, but like a little bit worse. No, it's not that bad actually. 
All right, let's see if it works. Bye. Did that? I still have a little bit of heartburn, but it's going away. I'm gonna eat. I'm having an Oyam bar. Never had it before. Um, people want to try it, especially since I'm not really like doing a super strict diet right now. So it's gonna be my first time eating it. Yeah, yeah. Not bad. Very good. Alright, so we're finishing this, and I'm gonna see you guys later. Alright, it's about 1 p.m. I did not film what I ate, but it's half a cup of brown rice with um, collard greens. About. A cup of collard greens and three ounces of chicken. That's what I had for lunch. Um, my heartburn. Oh, this one's bad. Oh, that's even worse. My heartburn is still here. Uh, I feel maybe a little bit better, uh, but I still have it. I've been looking up Thanksgiving recipes. I don't really hold back for Thanksgiving. It's that one day a year that I just go all out. Um, I do it at my mom's house, but I'm the one that cooks. Next year, hopefully the house will be ready and I will have it at mine, but um, we're still in the middle of moving everything. Uh, so I'll catch with you guys later. Just wanted to update what I was eating. Um, and I will see if I can give you guys a macros on all this. Bye. It's 3 p.m. and I'm having my, which is like fourth meal of the day, Chobani Greek yogurt in pumpkin, of course. Don't really recommend it. It has a lot of sugar. Mm, let me see. Let me show you. Calories is 130. Fat, 2.5. Carb, 16. Sugars, 12. Protein, 12. So it's not really good. Um, macro wise but I just want to taste it something pumpkin so that's my pumpkin for the day and um, that's all folks catch you guys later here at Home Depot I'm trying to fix my closet situation because your girl's got so much clothes and I gotta split now with Kevin um, so that's not good and I don't have any space it to get like a really nice wood closet but it's too much money for right now so just get like a regular wire thing and then we'll work on that um later on okay wink wink i get one for christmas or next year's christmas or birthday uh, not yet um yeah, let's try it use a machine that is not supposed to and I'm like on employee watch. So, I don't know, it's gonna be really ugly. I don't even have space for my shoes. But I gotta take my clothes out of my parents' house. Um, and yeah, this is the wiring that we're gonna get. Do you guys have anything special for your shoes? Because I don't know what to do with mine. Keep it looking weird because I'm wearing them. Oh well, I'm starting to get a little bit used to it. So, catch you guys later. Okay, what else we got? Guys, it's 5:18. Um, I am just preparing everything for tomorrow's lunch and breakfast. Um, here I made one cup egg whites. Um, I'm doing my, up. Oh, it just finished, my white rice, ah, that's hot, let me get a little thingy, so my white rice just finished, um, I get these steam in a bag, so much easier. So just did that. Um, 
I'm going to use the air fryer for the first time. I'm using Alexia sweet potatoes. Um, here is the air fryer. So it's my first time using it, so I'm pretty excited about that. Put it at 400. Oh, I was going to cut the thing with this. Um, you put the air fryer at 400 and you put it for about 20 to 20 minutes. I'm going to start with 15 and see what happens from there. So, in the air fryer goes, see it looks like this. It's the basket. Get, shake it around. Put it in there, lock it, and the time will be 15 minutes. I don't know if you guys can see, it hasn't adjusted. See, this is something I need to know how to get is those little cookies. Alrighty, so. Pretty much I've got all my snack for tomorrow. Got my turkey, four slices of Applegate turkey. This is the one that I use. Applegate Naturals. Um, it has no uh, antibiotics, gluten, casein-free, no nitrates or nitrates added. And I just realized that you guys were like, I was talking to you from a boob. I wanted to show you guys, this is the one that I used. Jasmine rice, boil in a bag. It's super easy. Uh, so I've been sitting here for a good like five minutes. And I'm like, why is the air fryer not making noise? I can to press start. Nope. Didn't press start, so of course. Now I gotta wait. So stupid, Monica. Now that that's cooking, finally, I'm going to show you guys what hubby's doing and the stuff we bought. So, this is for my shoes. I bought three of these, and then I bought one of these carts. I don't know if it'll work. Hi, Dutch. Dutch wants to get in. Hi, Dutch. This is all the wire stuff. You see, we're living out of luggages. This is all the wire stuff. Not really what I wanted, but it'll do for now. Then we'll get the real one. Right, babe? You're gonna get it for me? Christmas gift? Fuck off to you too, I feel the love. And let me show you guys this amazingness that is the iRobot. Is it iRobot? Yes. It is so awesome. Look at that, look at that. Dutch likes it. Get your in the way. Feeds all around the house for like two hours. And with how much uh, hair Dutch sheds, it's amazing. So, catch you guys later. So for dinner today, I'm not really in the mood for much. So I'm making myself some protein pancakes. Um, a scoop of protein powder. One teaspoon of PB2 and then one teaspoon of almond flour and a little bit of xanthan gum. So just mixing it now. Just one egg. Mix it in there. Finished my pancakes and gonna get some Walden Farms chocolate syrup. 16 grams of almond butter, and then I put about a tablespoon of Halo Top. Where is it? Halo Top. And I'm gonna put some Walden Farms now.
that doesn't look delicious. So I'm ending it here. This is my last meal of the day. I will catch you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. And give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. If not, then just forget it. <laughs> See you guys tomorrow. Bye.